We haven't even made it to Mesquite yet and unfortunately Carmen is car sick and she just threw up everywhere. It leaked out all over into the Calvin Klein bag that we had. All of Austin's clothes now have throw up all over them. Guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are spending our last little bit here in Vegas. We're gonna do some shopping. This is one of our favorite outlets to come to when we come to Vegas. It's the South Outlet Mall. They have a great Nike store, and this is what Austin wanted to do yesterday. We just did not have time, so we're gonna do that really fast before we have to head home. We found the sneaker vault. What the heck is this thing? It's like one of those games, obviously, where you like you pay a dollar, and this thing does what Austin would do. It's like put the key like into the slots. Into the slots. I don't see it. Like the see the triangle or the square things. So you have to try and, oh, it's trying to see the key turns, in there. And then it pulls it out. Oh, I see. So these so little the things edge. right there, they have to stick it in there to try and stick it over the shoes. It's super hard to in there. Oh, yeah. turn. You, is this like, does it take cash? Yeah. yeah. I'm trying this. Dollar it's per super plate. super hard though. I know. It's just, it's just a buck. Yeah. But it's super hard. I know. But what if I get lucky? <laughs> Austin, how much are these shoes over here? The Dior's? These Dior's over here in the bottom right hand corner. Mm, they can go for like 15 to 1700 bucks. Holy cow. So, this dollar here could give me some shoes that are 15. It may take two dollars because I don't even know how, like, I gotta get my timing just One dollar right. per play. One dollar per play. What? I don't understand how to do Yeah, yeah. I didn't understand all You click it, you click it, and, and then it starts to go up, and you have to click it again. So you gotta click it twice. Pretty sure. I knew it was gonna take another dollar to just try and get this thing figured out. <laughs> all right, take two. Take your notes. I don't get it. Too, too low. You don't want that. You have to hold it? Yeah. I don't know, I thought you had to click it twice. One more time. It doesn't make sense. You have to hold it. Yeah. Look at one. It's fine. What is it? Don't even go side. It doesn't go up. So the thing doesn't raise up. I don't think it goes up. Well, don't waste your money then. Oh no, you have to move this up too. This is that. This is what inserts it in. That's what goes up. That makes more sense. This is side to side and forward. Holy crap! It's wasting all this money. How much money are we gonna waste here? What's your guess? Um, thousand dollars. Thousand dollars. Five dollars. Five dollars. Well, what are we on now? Dollar number four? Yep. How do you go up? Like you hold it. Hold up. What's up? Too high. Oh, barely. What happened? Got your heart racing? <laughs> they probably like raised it up. It's like we're like perfect yeah. and then just raise. Yep. That's how these machines you work. Do you hold it down then, let go? That's how you get it up. Up a little bit. Good. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I totally, I got it this time. I totally have it. What is this, dollar number 10? No, it's a dollar seven. This is why we can't go to casinos, people. <laughs> it's a yeah, we're just like five steps in to really awesome. play cat control yourself. Oh, please. <laughs> I know when to stop, right? <laughs> Do you? Yes. What if it's not even your Dad, it's like it's just a little bit too tall every right. single time. No, there's people right here. Stop. Put your wall back in. I swear I had it. It's right. Keep it. Keep it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Really? Good. Oh, I got it. Oh, I got it. It's rigged. It doesn't let go. It raised up? Yeah, it's rigged. 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 Yep, they all are. I totally let go earlier. And then I let go earlier. Earlier, earlier. Oh, no, I like that. We barely touched it. <laughs> so as we knew all along, those machines are rigged, but yet we just wasted ten dollars right there. It wasn't ten bucks, maybe eight. Okay, whatever. We wasted eight dollars. <laughs> They're rigged every single time. They never work out. So we're moving on to stores where we can actually they, get something that's true, for them. I heard this one kid went in an iPad. Really? At a place like that. Yeah. Wow. He was in it like a hundred bucks, but he got it. <laughs> right? You get like a five, six hundred dollar iPad for hundred bucks. 
Maybe, if luck's on your side that day. There's this giant candy stand right in the middle of the mall. What is that? It's called jelly fruit. And jelly fruit? What's inside of it? Um, jelly? I don't know. But I saw one on YouTube and I want Ugh, it looks gross. They have any kind of bulk candy you could even imagine. I mean, sunny side up egg, you know, Legos, pretzels, whatever you can think of. Got some frogs. I've never seen so much bulk candy in my life. Sharks. Look at those gummy bears, Claire. Those are huge. Turtles. Some gummy fruits. Pizzas. It goes on and on and on all the way over there. All right, we're gonna try these little jelly fruits out. Not we'll to wait till we get home though, because you have to break them over a sink. Yeah. We don't want those all over in the car. So as soon as we get home, we're gonna bust those open. Come look what we found for you. Pineapple jelly fruit. Apparently, they're a trend on YouTube, so we are gonna join the trend and try those. Look at those itty bitty baby shoes. Those are so cute. We should get some for Ollie. The one is for Ollie. Ollie. Probably not. All right, Claire found oh, these like shoes right here at the front of the store. And, whoa, not those. Just keep falling down on us. These ones right here. But are they're super all mine. Cute. She's trying to decide if she likes them or not. The Nike Reacts. I mean, it's like I like them, but I don't they're know cute. if I love the yellow. You know what I mean? They're really cute. I'm not sure about those yet, though. Because I also want to look around just to see if there's any cuter shoes. Yeah, let's keep looking. We're looking for some shoes today. We are? Yes. You're kidding me, right? Those are cute. No, they're not. Those are cute. These are cute. Oh, no. Nothing happened. <laughs> Nothing happened here on this aisle. We have searched the Nike store high and low, and the only thing we found that Austin wants is this shirt right here. He says he's going to wear it to the gym. Is that correct? Just to the gym, you might want to try to find some tearaway pants to go with that. You know, you could rip off your pants before you do your squats or whatever. <laughs> the boys are supposed to be here in Tommy Hilfiger, however, we cannot find them. We're gonna go in and have a look. Terry and the girls are right in front of me. I think the boys are moving too quick. They're moving from store to store. <laughs> I can't find them. Don't know where they're at. Need some new sheets? Uh, not that color. So. I like white sheets. Yeah, I think that they moved. <laughs> All right, the boys are not in Tommy Hilfiger. I think they have left and gone to another store. They're probably at the food court, to be honest with you guys. They were not at the food court. They're in Calvin Klein Men's. I just saw Austin walk past over there. There he is. All right, we have found Austin. He is in the shorts department. Get some pretty short blue shorts. I'm sure they're not too short for you. Don't be, you <laughs> JV style. You don't want to be running back here at 8, 8 59 when it's not even 8 o'clock and they're kicking you out. What are you talking about? Yeah. Oh, oh, so we don't want to come back here. You want to make sure we get the right size right no, now. No, Dad, I'm talking about the locked out video. The at locked out video. Oh, that's true. Got it. So. Yes, we do not want to return these because we are headed north today, back home. You got two pairs of shorts? Have you found anything else? There is a sweatshirt aisle over there. That'd okay. Sweet. I mean, it is pretty hot outside. You sure a sweatshirt? Sweat, sweat, sweat shirt is a good idea. I would go with t shirts right now. I mean, if winter was coming, sweatshirt would be great. You sure you want to go with white swim shorts? I don't know if that's such a good idea. <laughs> you are? Yeah, all right, all right, you're bold, you're bold. Where's Owen at? He is way over here. We're gonna go over here and check on Owen, see if he's found anything. Carmen is with me right now. It's a pretty cute shirt. Yeah, it is. I need an extra small, I need an extra, extra small. Extra, extra? Extra, extra. I don't think these are your size, kiddo. Extra small. Did you know that we are in the Calvin Klein's men's section? So some dudes wear this shirt. It's cute. It is cute. It is cute. Okay, I Leave found there, mom. Though. I'm gonna go to mom. All right, my man. What did you find? These underwear-looking shorts. Underwear shorts. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds great. Kind of weird. <laughs> I'm sure they are if they're underwear shorts. It's kind of weird. 
Well, it's not like a thinner band. Huh. Interesting. All right. Throw it in the bag. Which ones? Those ones? No, those are, those are too much for me. Too much? Dude, I'm liking those. That's a lot going on. That's all right. Dude, that, those are awesome. Dude, I had these in black growing up right here. So it's black here with the white lettering for the air. They were awesome. I'm digging those black white ones right there. A little salt and pepper action on the back. I know you like little salt and pepper. Huh? It's not for me. <laughs> I mean, these shoes are kind of cool. Those the BF Flyers? Those are, those are, um, those are blazers. What about you, Claire? I think the right size. Guys, the girls just got their first pair of Jordans. It was crazy loud in there. They had the music cranked up to 100, so we couldn't get a lot of talking in. But we want to show you what they got. Carmen is excited about it. She was hoping for pink. But what color did you get, Carmen? I had to get boy shoes. You had to get boy shoes? Yeah. <laughs> I think they're still cute. Oh, yeah. First pair of Jordans. I couldn't be more proud. <laughs> Try them on. I want to wear them right now because my other shoes are kind of muffy. All right, let's put them on. See how they look. I should go buy some socks and I can put mine on. Just try them on without socks. Literally, it literally says boys inside. It does? Half my shoes say boys inside. That's okay. All right, Claire, let's see what you got. I wanted the white hot cup, but it's okay. These came inside. She wanted these, but they're big. That's all right. They didn't have the exact ones, but these ones are very, very close. All right, Claire. They're super cute. You yeah. going to put them on? Um, I need socks. You need socks. Yeah. Carmen's, she's willing to do without socks. Claire needs socks. No big deal. Totally understand. I don't like my other shoes. <laughs> no shoes. Actually, I really want to put mine. Alright, alright. Claire has changed her mind. Oh, perfect bad with this outfit. Look at this. Perfect with my outfit. So it does yeah. matches perfectly. Mine goes bad with my outfit. <laughs> Just the green on your surfboard, it matches. And they're not the same type of green. Pretty close. Pink. Boys just got out of pack sun, didn't find anything they were looking for or anything to cut the rye. So does that mean we're almost done? Can we get out of here? You ready to go back to Utah? What about you? You guys gonna sleep the whole way there? Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully. Wish I could sleep all the way there. Alright, Carmen, let's see what you got. Nice. I look bad with them on in this outfit. Oh, I think outfit. you look awesome. No, in this outfit I look horrible. Um, are they light? Yes. Can you run fast in them? I don't want to run in the mall, but we're going to do it. <laughs> Ready? Run. I don't want to run too fast. <laughs> Better with socks, but that's how I knew I had a good pair of shoes if I could run fast in them as a kid. Blair, I'm loving yours too, kiddo. You don't have to run in them, though. That's all right. Are right, you guys ready to go? All right, let's get out of here. We are headed out of the mall, but the kids wanted to stop and get a little treat on the way out. We stopped at Auntie Ant. Get some pretzels and some cheese, maybe. Okay, what kind of drink do y'all want? Water, lemonade. I think they got frozen lemonade. I want a pink one. Lemonade, strawberry, mango. We wrapped up our shopping for today. Everybody's back in the car with a little bit of a treat from Anne. We're gonna head home. Hopefully, everybody will sleep. Specifically, this little girl right here. She's Being tired Claire. and ornery. She needs to go to sleep. Me and Claire slept together at the hotel. And the reason I got no sleep is because Claire literally rolled on top of me and started sleeping. I know. <laughs> but guess what? Tonight you'll be back in your very own bed, your own space, and no one laying on top of you. Yep. We haven't even made it to Mesquite yet, and unfortunately Carmen is car sick and she just threw up everywhere. I tried to catch it in the bag, but I used one of the paper bags that we got at the mall and unfortunately that did not hold the throat very well <laughs> it leaked out all over into the calvin klein bag that we had all of austin's clothes now have throw up all over them we tried to rinse them all off at a gas station i don't know we're gonna go home and wash them they might be ruined honestly there's got like stains all over them and i'm hoping that i can get it out when we get home she threw up all over in her brand new 
Nike shoes. Air Jordans, <laughs> not just Nikes. She threw up all over brand new Jordans. It's inside and uh, all most of the Austin's clothes that he got are white. And now they're all stained because Carmen had like blueberries and raspberries for breakfast. <laughs> and now there's a bunch of purple and red spots all over his new jacket. Uh, uh, his white swim shorts did wash off, but his other white shorts, I think, are ruined. Um, but we did keep the receipt, so if we have to, we can return it. We are not returning it, you guys. <laughs> it's just a joke. I would never do that. <laughs> I'm going to try and wash them and put sand remover on them and hopefully be able to get all of that out. Um, I've had pretty good luck with that, so hopefully I can figure that out. But unfortunately, she's just not feeling great. We just gave her some Jemamine. Hopefully she can fall asleep, sleep it off. We've got some garbage bags, so we're prepared now. I'm using it as my blanket because I got She's cold, she accidentally threw up on her minky blanket. So she's using a garbage bag for a blanket. Why won't let me borrow hers? I don't blame her. <laughs> As we get home, we'll have to clean out your shoes and hopefully we can get it all out. Yeah. We are about an hour and a half away from home. Thankfully the drama being kicked in. Carmen hasn't thrown up since she threw up earlier today. Just having a little snack back there. We just made a quick pit stop for some gas. Getting so close to home. You guys, the temperature has dropped dramatically. We are at 80 degrees <laughs> instead of 115 degrees. So that is one thing to look forward to getting back here to Utah is that it's a much cooler. I noticed that our AC unit, like we hit a certain point and it finally got cold again. Yeah. Like it's been like lukewarm, like a little bit cold yeah. in, in spots. And all of a sudden, the temperature came down enough and our AC just like boom kicked in. I'm like, ooh, it's cold. Yeah, we had to like turn the temperature up in here because it was getting too cold. But in Vegas, it could hardly keep up with the heat. It was struggling. So our car is also glad to be back here in Utah. <laughs> <laughs> but we are so glad to be almost home. Everybody's tired. I don't think we slept very well. And we're looking forward to our own beds tonight. Guys, we have made it back home. It is 11 o'clock. We are just trying to clean up these clothes that we bought. These brand new clothes that uh, got thrown up on them. Terry is just in the laundry room right here, trying to get them all sprayed down, going through each one. Some wet just touched my toe. <laughs> what? Was there a throw up on that? The just sweat from the sprinting them out. Gosh, oh, it touched my toes. That's gross. Yeah. These are Owen shorts. Not my what did the What's the sweater look like? It actually doesn't look too bad. Really? Because it was looking terrible before. Yeah. Like, surprisingly, it's not. I don't know. We're going to wash it and see. And what about the shoe that got thrown up in? The Air Jordan. Oh, oh boy. It's a bad one. Yeah. Are we going to have to just wash it? Can you just wash it? I don't know. It makes me nervous to just wash it, but I don't. I honestly don't think I have a choice. Like, it literally <laughs> filled the shoe. <laughs> so. That, that is terrible. <laughs> Getting your first pair of Air Jordans and filling it full of throw up in the very same day. Yeah, bad we're deal. We're sorry, Michael Jordan. <laughs> we're sorry. Sorry to treat your shoes like this. That, that's a project for tomorrow. <laughs> Carmen had to change her pillowcase because it got a little bit of throw up on it. But she's got a cool new tie-dye one. Did you make that? Uh-huh. It looks awesome. I like it. And we got the dogs back. And Carmen and Austin went and picked up the dogs. That is correct. So they are happy to see us. You feeling all right? Yeah. You tired? Yeah. Ready for bed? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, go brush your teeth and head to bed. Okay. Good night. Good night. Are you ready for bed? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, we appreciate you hanging out with us in Vegas all weekend. Uh, we had a great time down there swimming, shopping, and uh, meeting our new friends. So Carmen here apparently has something to say what is it, Carmen? I just wanted to say, make sure you guys go subscribe to the Phillips Sam Bam. They are so sweet, so nice. One of the best people that we've ever clapped with. That, that is very true. We have invited the Phillips Fan Bam back here to Utah. So hopefully they uh, accept that and we'll get some good videos with those guys here in the future. So we appreciate you guys watching. We love you and I'll see you guys back here tomorrow.